Good afternoon. I'm Erica Sargent. Good to have you with us. I'm Joe Donlon. We begin here at five with a frightening attack at a northwest suburban park. And now a woman and a good Samaritan who came to her aid are in the hospital. Police see a man out walking his dog randomly attack the woman. His dog also biting her several times. CBS 2's Andrew Ramos is in McHenry with new details on what happened. I have never heard of anything like that that's happened here before. I mean, it's it's bizarre. Rick Wegman says he's at Peterson Park two to three times a week, and even on the busiest and sunniest days, he's never seen an altercation or even as much as an argument take place. So to hear that a brutal attack involving a dog happened right here in his backyard is hard to believe. It was probably a fluke incident, but um, I will certainly keep my eyes open, but uh, you know, I, I'm, a, I'm a dog owner. I have three dogs, big dogs, but uh, yeah, never, never. It wouldn't give me any pause at all to come here. I'll, I'll be here tomorrow. McHenry police say it happened Sunday at around 3.30 p.m. where a 59-year-old woman was walking her dog on a leash when she crossed paths with a man walking his dog that wasn't on a leash. And at some point, police say he brutally attacked her, stomping, kicking, and striking her head and neck several times, attempting to strangle her. His dog also biting her multiple times. That man has been identified as 47-year-old Raymond Link. He lives west of Milwaukee. The attack itself that happened in broad daylight, cops say, was unprovoked as both Link and the victim, who we have learned is a local realtor, did not know each other. I see a lot of families come here, and, you know, I come biking through here all the time, and it's just kind of shocking and terrifying that something like that happened here. Police say a good Samaritan intervened. That person, a 37-year-old man, attempted to help her, but he was seriously injured, also getting bit by the dog, and suffered a broken clavicle in the confrontation. Both victims were hospitalized and treated for their injuries. Link was placed in custody. His dog, after running from the park, now in the custody of McHenry County Animal Control. Link is charged with attempted murder, two counts of aggravated battery with great bodily harm, one count of aggravated battery by strangulation, and two counts of aggravated battery in a public place. The incident has rattled some who live in the area. I probably wouldn't come alone anymore, so that's kind of scary. Like, I wanted to start doing these things alone, but now I don't, I feel uneasy. Now, Link is currently being held at McHenry County Jail, awaiting a detention hearing, which was scheduled for late Monday. Reporting in McHenry, Andrew Ramos, CBS 2 News.